Hi, this is my new saw machine. I bought it at a yard sale last Saturday for ten dollars. Um, pretty cool. It's made by New Home. Um, the serial numbers on it is right here. We looked up the serial number on the website, and this machine was made in 1898. So it's 111 years old. The guy who sold it to me said he had had his TV sitting on it for about 20 years, and he didn't. He he thought it was a friend of his grandmother's that, that owned it. Um, he didn't know much about it, except that it made a good TV stand. So I brought it home. Um, when we got it home, we found stuff in the drawers. Um, fabric under the presser foot. It came with this new Home Soul Machine Company box. Everything that came with it. There's a ruffler foot in here, and there's a couple other things. I'm sure I'll never know what they are, but I think, um, I think she did a little quilting. I found some quilting thread in here. Um, part of the coolest thing about it, it was that all the stuff that was still in the in the drawers. I'm cleaning the drawers so I have it out. But um, it came with this little sewing kit. This company, this furniture company, I believe, burned down in 1966. So and it came with a 25 cent uh, satin ribbon, 35 cent rayon elastic. Lots of spools of 19 cent thread. That's pretty cool. She also looks like she had some templates in here that maybe she did a little quilting. This came in the in the drawer too. And if you open it up, oops. Okay, so if you open it up, the date on this is October the 12th, 1966. So. Um, kind of neat. Found all this old stuff in the drawer. It was completely stuck, wouldn't work. It took me a half a bottle of machine oil and a good number of hours to clean it up and get it going. So, I'm going to see if we can get it to sew. It comes with a little a bobbin, like a shuttle bobbin. Wound it. It's got a bobbin winder on it that you can wind the bobbin on. Um, I don't know how to thread it. I just kind of did what I thought it would probably do. I think this is the tension. We will uh, see what I can do. Came with some extra belts. The uh, belt wouldn't work. They keep breaking, so I had to duct tape it together. So please forgive my duct tape. But I, so it slips, so I have to treadle twice as fast as I want it to go. Let's see if we get ready here. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. Belt's getting ready to break again, I think, so we'll see if we can get it to get it to work here though. There we go. Try to with one foot, I'm not sure how you're really supposed to treadle. See a little bob and wander going back and forth. Got some slippage in the belt, so I brought the brought this out to help give it a little tension, so Yep, looks good. 110 years old. Hundred and ten, hundred and eleven year old machine. So it's pretty good. That's pretty impressive. Anyway, there's my ten dollar yard sale find. Hope you like it.